As of right now, do you think that pay raises uh, for state employees and teachers are, are on the chopping block? I think they certainly have to be part of the uh, discussion. Um, it's, it, it is a bit of a contradiction if we have as many Tennesseans who have had to go on to unemployment and have been furloughed uh, for the, you then to turn around and be do, doing pay raises for state employees. I think they understand that. They live in these same communities. They have friends and neighbors who have lost their jobs as a result of the pandemic. And so I think taxpayers would expect us to be somewhat frugal uh, during this time. And I think the folks who really serve this state, which are the, the state employees, understand the, the financial position that we find ourselves in. So I think that certainly would be part of the conversation because it's a, uh, you know, it's a cost increase that we just may not have the resources to, to do in the coming year. We talked about uh, pay raises being on the table. Well, what else is on the chopping block, do you think? I don't think there's, I think anything that is new uh, has to be uh, reviewed and looked at. What about vouchers? I, I think it has to be looked at. Uh, obviously, the administration, that's a, that's a key item to them. But I think to, in, the, in fairness, um, if you're going to look at everything, then you're going to look at everything. And again, uh, we're at the stage where the budget that we've passed, uh, we felt like uh, included the really important stuff and the essential stuff. We are now at the phase where we are looking at what are the essential things of government that we need to fund. And that's a hard discussion. That's a really hard discussion because there's a lot of good things uh, in the budget currently that many members, uh, myself included, would like to see remain in the budget that we're simply not going to have the resources to, uh, to fund. 